guys um lasagna i love the lasagna with meat sauce i also like the other lasagna without meat sauce so today we're going to show you the lasagna with meat sauce it's got 280 calories i'm gonna open it up here i really like the tomato sauce meals that nutrisystem has this is one of my favorites I'm trying to get back into the swing of things i didn't eat nutrisystem probably for about two weeks because of the wedding and we had family and um, I had a few meals, but not so much. And you don't know how bad I wanted to go to McDonald's tonight, but I was like, nope, nope, you gotta get back on the program. So, yeah, discipline came home instead. All right, so this is what it looks like. I know it doesn't look as appetizing as it tastes. So there's uh, some meat sauce, some little meat, and then layers of lasagna. And I think there's like some bean and stuff. See some veggies. I like it. I like it a lot. Um, this is some kind of like cheese kind of thing right here. And again, I know it's not as appetizing to look at as it tastes, but it's delicious. And I like to eat it with spinach. Okay, so let's take a taste of this. And I don't usually take it out of the container. Mmm. So this is it, if you can see it, and I will show you I like it. Let's see how hot it is. You can see the steam coming off of that. Too hot. Yeah, I probably overheated it. Mm -mm -mm. Can I have the Chef Boyardee taste to it? Which, when I was a kid, I didn't eat peanut butter and jelly. I ate Jeff Boyardee a lot because uh, the person I had lunch with, they liked to make peanut butter and jelly. And so my mother would send me with cans of Chef Boyardee. So anyway, and then after that phase, it was liver sausage and carrots. Anyway, which I love liver sausage. But it's good. Thumbs up. Love the lasagna. If you haven't tried it, give it a chance. It tastes good. See you later. Hey guys, um, today we're going to review the turkey and stuffing. Um, I also get the turkey and stuffing which is frozen and I'll do that too so you can see the difference. This is pretty good if you've got um, the regular meals and not the frozen meals. This seems more like lunch meat turkey kind of or it's thin sliced and the other one's chunkier. But you'll see it because I'll put the other one on this video as well. So this is what it looks like before you microwave it. And you can see there's stuffing underneath. So it's sort of like turkey slices with stuffing and gravy. And the stuffing has, I think, water chestnuts in it because it's kind of crunchy. Um, that took a while for me to use to because I'm not really into crunchy stuffing. But it's good. Let's put that in for a minute. And then, all right, so let's peel it back. All right, so you can see that turkey is like slices, which when I show you the other one, you'll see it's like thick chunks of turkey. So this is more kind of like lunch meat turkey. And then below that is some stuffing, which has its crunch from like, I think there's water, that, that's a water chestnut right there. Can you see that? Oh, oh, I'm in the way of the lighting. I guess that is a water chestnut. So it is kind of give you some crunch. Okay. All right. I got to be really quick because the Walking Dead's coming on. Okay. This is what it looks like. It's, um, doesn't look as good as it tastes. So here's the stuffing. It's pretty hot. Mm-hmm. That's good. Yeah, the water chestnuts. Can you see that? It is really good, guys. You know, in the beginning when I ordered Nutrisystem, I didn't get the frozen food. I started off with the regular food until they had um, a special discount. Uh, they have sales that they run. And then I switched. And I actually wound up paying less for the regular and frozen food than I did just the regular food. And then there's the turkey meat. Mmm. 
the list. But I gotta go now because The Walking Dead already started. Oh my god. Hi. Well, I, I can't believe it. Let me fix my hair. Does anybody notice I really did my eyebrows? Yeah, right. <laughs> hey guys. Alright, so like I said, here is the roasted turkey medallions. It is the frozen. Um, I showed you a few minutes ago the non frozen turkey. And I said that I like this better, which I do, but you don't get stuffing with it. You get mashed potatoes and turkey medallions. And um, my nutrition system order is going to be here. And I'm going to. Aww, Billy Boo. Oh, Dan the Zombie Man. That's for Dan the Zombie Man. My hero. Anyway, okay, so I'm back on Nutrisystem. It's after the wedding. I was off of it like a month. And I probably gained some pounds back because I ate wedding cake. So I finally had to just take that rest of that wedding cake and just dump it in the trash. Because I was like undoing the stuff that I've already done. So not good. But you only get married once, hopefully, right? Well, maybe for me twice or whatever. Anyway, so here's the turkey medallions. And let's open it up. So this is what it looks like, frozen. And we're going to put it in. I'm not a big clean freak. And you know they're hearing everything you guys are talking about. We've got, we've got like my mom here and stuff, so it's like a uh, busy house, busy house. How long do we put it in for? Three minutes? Okay, now we've got to, like after it beeps, we've got to stir it and put it in for two more minutes. Oh, this is recording the whole time? Yeah. Oh my god, take me out of this, bro. Oh my god. Yeah, you gotta take that out. Soon if you put this in, it's gonna be big trouble on the internet. Dr. Lola. Oh yeah, there's still a little, like, frozen pieces in here. After the three minutes, you have to put it in for two more minutes. You want green bean? Green bean? Back at the ranch, like you guys don't join the nutrient system. I had tilapia and uh, some rice, pretty tasty. You want this bedroom door open for the Emily room? The light's on. Okay, uh, turn the light off. Close the door, right? Yeah, go ahead. Maybe get some bigger than a strip of fish. Life in the fast lane. All right, guys, it's ready. Let's see what we got. So the meat is thicker, and there's no stuffing, but there is some yummy mashed potatoes here. And you don't get tons of meat, but it's very filling. I've not eaten this and been hungry afterwards. How come I don't get mashed taters? You always get you get mashed taters, you get rice. Yeah, I would cut out like a... A carb diet. I don't get bread. I don't get potatoes. I don't get pasta. Yeah, I, that's why I like Nutrisystem too because I get a little bit of that stuff. So here's the mashed potatoes, and you can't, you know, it's a, it's like a good consistency, as you can see. It's very fluffy. Um, sometimes it can be a little thick, but I have some spray butter, zero calorie that I spray on there. And then here's the, the difference in the meat. The other one was more like, uh, you know, lunch meat. And this one is medallions. 
and there's some dark meat which makes it moister or at least it appears to be dark meat so let's try it okay so here it is mashed potatoes medallions and some gravy and I usually eat this with some green beans but I like both though because one gives you stuffing and one gives you mashed potatoes so I gotta let this cool off a bit before the wedding when I was doing Nutrisystem I lost like 20 pounds did I show you my 10 pound bear? so this is the Nutri bear that you got you get one for every 10 pounds lost and so this is the bear I got for my first 10 pounds Did my Nutri bear so um, I didn't submit for the 20 pound bear yet because I knew I'd probably gain a little weight back at the wedding So, but I will alright so this is the spray butter I use, by the way, and I don't put a lot on it. Just probably give it like four sprays. Just get a little medallion and some gravy. That's what that looks like there. Mm -hmm. Man, I love this stuff. When I wanted to do my order, I wanted to get tons of this stuff, but they had short inventory. I could only get three. I hope I got three coming because sometimes if they run low, they'll substitute an item. But of course, it's Thanksgiving time, right? So people are wanting the turkey and mashed potatoes. But okay, guys, I will do my next unboxing for you guys. Get back on the program. Get it going again. I'll see you later. Bye. Hey, guys. Lunch tur uh, tuna salad. I put it in the fridge to get it cold and it tastes better when it's cold. So, I wasn't a huge fan of this when it's lukewarm. I think it tastes kind of undesirable, but cold, it tastes much better. So this is, comes in a pouch like that, and you gotta kind of scoop it out. I know it's kind of gross. But you just scoop it out. Just scoop it out, I use my long spoon. So I don't have to get all over my fingers. And then you can eat it with a roll. Um, but I like, like to eat it with a few whole wheat crackers. So then I got most of it out, see? And for my crackers, I use multigrain club. It isn't that bad. It's 60 calories for four crackers and um, 10 grams of carbs. The tuna has three grams of carbs for the whole thing. So you're allowed like 30 to 40 grams of carbs if you're a diabetic per meal. So you can technically have like 12 crackers. So I'll have six crackers with it. Four crackers is 10 grams of carbs. So I'll be getting 15 grams of carbs of that. Plus the three grams from the tuna salad, 18 grams of carbs. So you just put it on there like so. Look, it doesn't fall. I think there's a lot of chestnuts in there to make it kind of crunchy. It's very good. Try it. Alright guys, bye.